Can quantum technologies help us fight the climate crisis? It's no secret that our world is run by computers. Banks, social media, the government, they all rely on intense computations being made all the time in servers hidden somewhere in the world. But these computations spend a lot of energy. So it's important to find new ways of doing them, but in a more efficient way. Now, traditional computers have an interesting way in which they lose energy. And this happens any time they lose information. So picture this. You ask the computer to multiply any number by zero. Whether it's two times zero or a hundred times zero, the result will always be the same. It will figure out alone that the answer is zero. But just from that answer, it's not able to work backwards and see if you multiplied two times zero or a hundred times zero. This means that it lost information. And there is a principle called Landauer's principle that says that any time information is lost in this way, there is also energy that's irretrievably lost as heat into the environment. Now, the interesting part is that quantum computers don't suffer from the same limitation. So for my PhD, we wanted to understand if quantum computers can help us save energy. So, we went into the lab and we made the quantum computer do something that normal computers do. And we studied all of the ways that it spent energy. We understood that computers still have a really long way to go before they are as energy efficient as normal computers. But we identified ways to get there. We are also trying to understand if quantum technologies have some sort of limitation to their energy efficiency, even in principle, and whether this will have an impact on big computations. At the very least, quantum computers may help us save energy in those tasks where they are so much faster than normal computers. A good example for, of this is cryptography. The climate crisis poses a lot of threats. So it's important to understand if there are new ways with which we can save energy. Quantum technologies may help, and we are trying to understand how.